Um, my name is Carla Jawaki. Um, I'm covering a maternity leave role for Justine Whipper as a PDM at Cricket New South Wales. So looking forward to start on the 22nd of June. I think the role, it's, it's a very exciting opportunity for me. Uh, coming from a sporting background, um, I'm very interested in uh, working with athletes and transitioning from into sport and out of sport. Having gone through the full journey myself, um, I, I really am interested in, in developing players and seeing them get the most out of sort of the off-field and on-field um, opportunities. Yeah, I've, um, I've come the full circle really. Started off as a junior going through the AIS program um, Started my playing career in Adelaide, um, played a couple of, um, went up through the state program, didn't make many state teams as a junior, got an opportunity when I was 19 um, in, in state and then got picked up by the AIS. From there, I uh, thought I'd just have a, a year at the AIS and go back to my job um, working at a council in Adelaide and got picked up by Queensland Firebirds, so moved states um, to play to play there. Had some friends that went over, so that transition was quite easy. Had a, had a ready-made house and, and a place to live. Um, from there, I played there a few years and then had, um, had a big injury, did my ACL. So I was out for nine months, um, did the full recovery, came back um, to only do it again 12 months later. Thought that for me was the end of, end of my playing career and I think you realise um, after you've had a few injuries that I thought I was spat out the other end of sport and thought I was done. Um, and at that stage I didn't have much in, in the way of work, I was studying a bit with uni, picking it up here and there, but had to work full time as well to, to supplement playing um, as well as living out of home. So I didn't, I didn't really have myself set up at that stage and um, for me a big injury or my second injury really hammered at home that I needed to do something. So I went into a, a marketing role uh, working full time at um, University of Queensland and um, from there I was actually contacted by the UK to go over and play netball over there and um, I saw that as an opportunity that when I thought my career was, was dead and buried to, to kind of revive it. So I went overseas, studied, um, their, their programs linked with the university, so went over and studied and played netball there. Uh, had, a, had a decent season, got asked to come back and play in the ANZ Champs, which had just been, uh, was in the second year and was getting quite a bit of traction and was getting quite big in Australia. So I came back, um, played for Queensland for a year and went back over to continue studying a Masters over in the UK. Um, had a two year visa, so was uh, kicked out the country and, and came back to Australia again and was fortunate enough to be picked up with the, uh, the New South Wales Swifts and played um, five years with them and at the same time balanced full time work again, um, did a bit of study on the, on the side and, and then have been picked up by, by Melbourne. So now at the age of 32 I'm, I'm thinking about what's next for me and um, it's taken me a long while to realise what my passion is and it's certainly in sport and, and helping other athletes kind of overcome injuries and, and balancing, uh, balancing the, whole, the whole gamut really of, of study and work and, and the importance of all, all three. I feel like I've got the experience behind me to to give. Um, oh, I speak. I, I come from. I've, I've experienced it, so I feel like I've lived it to be able to tell the story. So it's there's certainly a lot that you can learn from a book, and I think that that's important. But I also think having that that real life experience, I can speak from the heart and and actually. Um, I'm an example of of why you need to have a um, have a well balanced and a well-balanced lifestyle to support the, the sports side of things. I love sport, I love all sport. Um, I really got into the BBL this year so I'm quite keen to, to be around the cricket athletes and, um, and sport in general. So rugby league's big in Sydney, um, I'm more of an AFL girl myself so um, just being around sport again is, is really nice and that's what I've also enjoyed here in Melbourne is all the, all the sport and how passionate they are here.